Greetings. Uh, welcome back to another episode of Delisa's Life Dance. Yours truly, Delisa, and it is a fantastic Friday. And today I am going to speak on spirit um, and let you know that spirit is part of the whole, part of the whole human existence is spirit. And things happen that have no explanation and it's got to be spirit it's got to be that connection that one has to the universe and to God and to their inner being to get them through certain situations and certain uh, certain aspects of life and I speak to that because I am happen to be an expert in that <laughs> in spirit and I've learned from some of the best and so as I come to you today uh, and bring to you a little episode of the spirit on Delisa's life dance where we talk about mind body and spirit I want to share with you a aspect of my life that is oh so important and that is spirit and that is the spirit of my dance and connection with the continent of Africa where my ancestors were taken from years many many years ago were kidnapped and enslaved and out of that I was born into a new generation of Africans in America and I just want to let you know that spirit resonates through the generations and I've learned that from an incredible being um, there are no accidents in fact but I've learned that after traveling 3,000 miles away from my place of birth in Buffalo, New York to Albany, California. And after that journey and realizing that I always connected with Africa and African dance through my life, I shared a little bit about that with being part of Garth Bangan Dance and being part of Geneva uh, Ensemble and being in, in a Spike Lee video for <laughs> with Arrested Development. I don't know if I shared that with you, but I've always been called to African dance. Um, this is the movie Malcolm X, and the and the uh, video that Spike Lee did was uh, Revolution. So and it was by Arrested Development, and I have about two seconds of fame in that video. I remember the shoot in New York City in Brooklyn by 40 acres and a mule, and it was an amazing time. So I just want to let you know that I've always been called to Africa, I've always been called to my ancestors, and after being dropped in California with a new family over 20 years ago, I found my way to, through church actually, and that's from Spirit, through church and through the community and they were looking one day they were looking for a barefoot dance class teacher and because I had done classes with Geneva and I emailed him and I said you know I want I love the way your classes run and I've taken a few classes here down at Malanga Center and as being a new mother traveling several seven miles to Oakland from Albany was a little bit challenging so when this article came up I said let's go Delisa I've always been a lady that takes action so with that said, I was able to meet out of doing that beginning West African dance class in um, Albany, California, little Albany, <laughs> I think one by 1.1 miles, I was able to teach dance to several people and I'm still friends with them, with drummers, with live music, and that is how I met a, an amazing woman and became part of her dance ensemble and I just like to honor the spirit of women uh, as it is Mother's Day weekend I want to honor the spirit of women I want to honor the spirit of two incredible women that have impacted my life from that little little class in Albany California beginning West African dance class I taught with Butch Haynes Duncan Allard and Sean Arenata and Garrett <laughs> many, many, many more drummers have dropped in on my classes, and Elizabeth played Hosho and Nestor, and that community from many moons ago launched me into another segment of life where I met the most incredible two women of my life journey. 
and um, I'd like to say they both are very heavy hitters and I just like to show you a picture of them that I keep in my home that we did the San Francisco oh here goes the camera again we did the San Francisco ethnic dance festival that was 2010 my first experience let's see if we can get it again my there they are my first experience on a professional level well really um, in a group level I've d danced professionally but on a group level with Dr. Marsha Treadwell and Dr. Honorable Dr. Julia Tsitsi Chigamba and I am part of the Chinyakari Ensemble and in 2001 this is where that bond began between three women, mind, body, spirit, all intertwined, ever changing throughout the years, all of us wearing all three hats for all that we do. And Dr. Treadwell, she is a heavy, heavy hitter and a humble spirit. She's done work with children with sickle cell anemia for over 25 years. She spearheaded teaching doctors all around the world how to deal with the psychological aspect in their communities, in traditional communities in Africa. She has taught and she has brought so much to the world about sickle cell anemia. And um, with that said, I just want to thank her for her work. She's got many, many awards and accolades. And she is one of the humblest, most beautiful beings on the planet. And she's my friend and mentor. And I've danced with her for many, many years with the next honorable doctor, Julia Chigamba, Julia Titsi Chigamba. And this is a picture of her as we are in the catalog for the Ethnic Dance Festival in 10, 2010. I've gone on to dance in many, 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 many shows with Julia and Marsha and uh, myself and the other members of the Chinikari Ensemble, which we all are very, very unique. And we all bring ourselves, our ancestors, we bring it. And it's that spirituality that I'm talking, I'm highlighting about three women. But there is also Sarah Noel, another woman that is just amazing. Happy Mother's Day to Sarah. And I'd also like to really honor, and Julia will always say, this is my mom, and that's Master Ronnie Dalio. And you have to come to our shows, meet these people, and of course, Russ Landers. You couldn't have a Chinukai without Russ Landers, Sarah's husband. And Russ is just another, like, God, my God, fantastic and theater player, marimba player, teacher, patient, loving, kind, gentle, leadership. Just, I, I can't talk enough about this group that I've been with. And I also want to mention our Casey, our Gogo, our auntie, our driver. She moves us. She gets us into action. And I just want to say happy birthday to you, Casey. Her birthday is on May 17th. And I didn't even mention the other May birthdays of Olga and Gerald, Julia's children, who are another entity that just drives us and keeps us focused on tradition and is, that are always there, that have our backs, that we worked hard on. And the amazing baby, well, baby, baby number three. <laughs> <laughs> Kanakai Chiamba and she is another up and coming fast leader in the African community in the African dance community in another generation of bringing traditional dance to people of California and beyond and I just want to mention that we have a beautiful family and Julia has support from her spouse Elon and she has support from her other two children and that is Ella and Pepkai what a family, plus a vast community that Julia Chigamba has built in the city of Oakland and across borders around the nation, around the world, Sweden, Canada, Africa, you know, everywhere. Um, where this woman goes is just amazing because spirit is with her. It resonates with her. And I'm just going to continue to talk about my mentor, 
Julia Tsitsi Chigamba and wish her a very happy birthday, May 11th, and a happy, happy Mother's Day, May 12th. And I just, as a, a member of the dance group and as a, um, I'm not wanting to toot my own horn, but I, I'm, I'm the hunter spirit. I'm in touch with my hunter spirit. I'm always finding things and, you know, I just want to say thank you to the group. Take this time on my YouTube channel to say have a happy Mother's Day to everyone that's watching out there and for all the men you've had a mother and just, you know, be in touch with that mother spirit this weekend. If your mother has gone on, has moved on as my mother has, and as my sister has transitioned, and as so many other mothers that I know around the planet and in my life that have made their transition, I just want to say they're still there. They're still watching us. They're still teaching us in their absence, in their physical absence, because what we say and what I've learned from the Shona people is that, and especially Julia Chiyamba, is that when we dance, when we bring this music, the traditional music of Zimbabwe to people, it puts us in another place. I've always known with myself, with my heart, that when I dance, when I African dance, I'm in another place and I am connected with spirit. I've always said it's my God spot. And so as I grew with the Shona music and the Shona traditions and Shona dance and in Dabeli and the dances in Babwe and that region of Africa, all the dances that have been taught to me by Julia and Ronnie and Kanakai and Olga and Gerald and everyone else that I've learned from, from the vast country of Zimbabwe. Um, I just wanna say thank you again. I, I gave y'all a shout out, but um, Dealing with women, the spirit of women, and how that drives the world. And I just want to say, happy Mother's Day. Have a wonderful day. I'm going to have a little drink of water because you know that's what I do. It's my 9.5. I'm talking a lot. So if there's anything that you liked about what I said on this channel, please subscribe to my channel. Hit the like button. Hit the bell notification. Put a comment down. Let me know what you want to hear. And I just want to say, this is, I want to do some more show and tell. This is Marsha. Oh, my God. And I didn't know if you knew this, but remember Nanai Gurira? You know, Black Panther before Black Panther happened? She's a playwright. And guess what? The Marin Theater Company did one of her plays, The Convert. And guess what? My dance director, Julia Chigamba, was the cultural consultant and vocalist for that play. I'll never forget it. It was it was just fantastic. So Denai is an is she speaks for herself. Thank you so much for your work. Thank you for writing plays and continue to write. And I'm on 13 minutes. Oh my god, I've never had one this long. So happy Mother's Day, everybody. Woohoo! Play a little ho show. Thank you. Connect with your spirit, everybody. Thank your mom. Connect if you're not a mom. You have a mother spirit. We're on Mother Earth. Love y'all. Bye-bye.